everybody, my name is Jojo, and today I am playing Seven Days to Die once again. I hope that you all are having an amazing day. If not, keep watching so that your day can get better and better from here on out. Before we get started too far into the video, I do want to read the verse of the day from the Version Bible app. That is a free app that you can read the Bible in all sorts of different versions. I like it because I think that it starts off all of my videos with the right dose of positive a day. Today's verse is 2 Timothy chapter 1, verse 7, and it says, For God has not given us a spirit of fear, but one of power, love, and sound judgment. Now, Timothy is one of the books that uh, Paul wrote. It was a letter to uh, Timothy, who was pastoring a, or ministering to with a church. Um, and, uh, yeah, um, he often was, like, you know, not respected because he was younger and things like that, so... You know, um, as you can, oh boy, you aren't supposed to be able to spawn in near me yet. You, you jerk, you jerk, I don't even have a weapon yet. Oops, I'm gonna punch you in the face. Yeah, knock you on the ground, punch you in the face. Excuse me, sir, you have something on your face. Uh, there we go, took him out. Oh, my knuckles hurt now. Um, okay, let's, uh... Let's go find a, a thing to harvest stones off of. There's another zombie way out there. You see him, right? I hope you see him. Otherwise I look crazy. Well, I mean, I am crazy. <laughs> Anyways, um, moving on. Let's go on ahead and do this. Um, but as I was saying, you guys could probably notice, this looks a little bit different then um it, it usually is the, the opening quest is different and why in the world have i even decided to like start a new world well mon ami um i would have you know that um currently this is version 1.0 of seven days to die that's right seven days to die has officially left the alpha it is now in the official start of its um, full thing of a doohickey, its whole new, um, yay! Thank you, Noah. It's it's now officially released. It's experimental right now, so there's probably gonna be some like issues and stuff with the game, like glitches and whatnot. But um, we're not gonna worry too much about that. We're not gonna worry too much about that at all. We are actually going to go and okay, so we're gonna have to head over there. Um, let's spend our skill points real quick. Uh, I want to go and focus on strength a little bit, and I do honestly want to um, um, get a stone sledgehammer. So, sledge. A stone sledgehammer. Okay. We're going to clear out this house real quick um, over here. We're going to make it our own. But yeah. Okay. Grab you. Boom, boom. Scrub you. Boom. There we go. Ta da! Okay. Ooh. Hello, crawler. Taking you out. Boom. Gotcha. Ha ha. We're just clearing this place out here. And then we're going to do the homesteading set of quests. I really am, like, wanting to avoid going to the trader because he's going to have me do a dig quest first. I don't like dig quests. Yes, a shovel. Here we go. Stone sledge. Thank you. After I crafted the level one. I'm so glad. There we go. Okay, collect some of this wood here. Because that's always going to be good to have lots and lots of materials. Um, okay, here we are. Um, Alright, let's loot the truck here. Blue pickup truck. Do, 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 do. Um, okay, there's some scrap stuff. Okay, so now time to head in here. Uh, no, we're not going there. Ooh. Grabbing you. Okay, good, some murky water. Uh, that's another thing. They changed how you make a, um, dew collector, which is good. I like the way that they changed it. We will grab you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't, don't be mad at me. Don't hate. Don't hate me. Break your ribs. 
smash it, smash it. Oh, you want a piece of this as well? <laughs> I love the sledgehammer. They just, they smash everything. They smash everything so hard. Boom, boom, cow, cow, what you done? Boom, boom. I'm... I, if you, if you guys, if you guys want to subscribe, oh yeah, it's a cooking grill, a cooking grill, I got that, what are they on? And a cooking pot is, like, a million percent better, but, you know what, we got a grill. Um, bone knife, Grab that, scrap you, scrap you, boom, we need a knife for harvesting, See Daisy. Okay, I'm gonna do some sneaky damage because I don't want to get surrounded. Ooh, kill some zombies. Yes, we'll take you. Taking you out. Okay. Out we go. Something got mad and smacked on a door. And I am not about to just get eaten. I think it's upstairs. Um, I also think I need some more feathers and stuff because I don't have uh, any um, um, arrows anymore. Grab you. Hmm, hello? Oh, it's just the shadows moving. Okay. Okay. Whatever it was broke the door. Oh. Oh, okay. So here we are. Smack your face. Then smack your face. And then smack your face again. Okay. In we go. Oh, forgot to search that. Okay. I'm gonna definitely need to break all of the noise traps. Die. Hit your chest. Break your ribs. Emergency broadcast system? I'm sorry, I don't think it works. Cause uh... You didn't get warned about me. Boom, boom. Okay. In here? Um... Okay. We're just gonna search everything. No pistol from the toilet. Womp womp. Oh. Well, everything is ours. Okay, um. We've gotten a decent set of stuff. Some steroids. Okay. Let's go on ahead and clear out this house before. Okay. Bandit armor plating mod. Perfecto! Okay, over here. We're gonna go over into challenges. Oh. Thank you for, for doing that. Okay, homesteading. I need some more small stones. There we go. Boom. Completed that. Okay, now we're going to go on ahead and um, we're going to craft ourselves a campfire, obviously. We're going to go put our campfire down. Um, and then we are going to drop off the stuff that we want to keep and don't want to sell or anything. Then we're going to head to the trader. Um, we will put the campfire um, in a kitchen. I don't really want to keep glass on me at all. Oh, you can go in there. And then we can, um, once we... Yep, sure, we'll put it on top of the stove. That is perfect. Okay. Now, we go upstairs. We drop everything down. Okay, that is our setup there. Uh, I'm gonna definitely need to collect some stones on my way, but that'll be easy to do. Alright, and uh, on our way to the trader, we uh, go. Okay, let's see here. Um, ooh, nope, that's... That is uh, for acid. Um, let's go with home cooking. It's gonna be you hungry yourself, then. Yes, I am hungry. I will scrap you, actually. I'll be keeping you. Um. Okay. 
A sale is a sale, even if it is to a scumbag like you. Yes, sir. Okay, now I'll to the buried to supplies thing. Next time, bathe. He's so mean. Oi! Bo. Get over here so I can smack your face. Ow! He hit me in the face. You guys saw that, right? He, sh he has no right to hit me in the face. That is not a gentleman. Yay, some more rocks. Oh, hello, Tom Clark. I exploded your face. Okay. Um, I'm just gonna try and dig right here. Um, okay, well, I'll cut to when I have the supplies because th this is this is just so tedious. I hate digging. I'm gonna need to get ready to sprint because the zombies will come as soon as you grab anything. Okay. Where are you at? There you are. Boom! Smack your face. Ha. No one is better than the potato. Okay, let's go see if uh, Wrecked has any cleared quests. Those are way better than buried supplies. I don't like just- Yes! Some honey! I have emergency honey in case I get infected, which is perfecto. Okay. Hello, sir? Boom. Okay. Now what he's going to do here is he's going to offer me a couple different bundles. The pipe machine gun, the rifle, or, this is all going to be pipe. The pipe machine gun, the pipe rifle, pipe pistol, uh, pipe baton, and pipe um, shotgun bundles for um, completing this quest. I'm going to go with the pipe shotgun. Um, the pipe shotgun is like the worst shotgun in the game and honestly I don't even like using it very often. Stop. Stop it. Um... So, like, um, mostly what I prefer to do is uh, get in straight to the double barrel, but can't really do that. And I don't really want to use a gun I'm not really specced for, because I'm going with strength right now. Um, perish. I will smack you in the face and break your ribs with my sledgehammer. Ha 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 ha. Okay, I'm also eight degrees over encumbered, which is not good. Um... I'm going to have to, ugh, out of stamina. Ew. Okay, let's go ahead and eat the ration here. Um, I'm also gonna go ahead and make myself, ugh. Ouch. I, I accidentally angered him. Okay. Um, what I was gonna say was making myself some more stone arrows, which will be good. Um... For keeping my ammo oh, high, and it all it also drops down my um, encumbrance level by using up all the spare parts. So, alrighty, wrecked. What you got for me? Okay, whatever. Thank you. Okay, and any jobs clear up, zombies? Just there are there should be a finite number of zombies in an area, since there are a finite number of people in an area. So if you can kill all of the people who have become zombies, eventually they'll like it'll run out of zombies. I know that the number of human beings on the planet is like close to eight billion, but like you don't have to kill all eight billion people because not all of them are zombies for one thing, and for another thing, not all of them are going to be in your immediate area. So like you you could technically just like you know. Kill all the people, like, it'll be like 30,000 if, like, 30,000 about for what this is like, Naves Gain, Arizona. So, like, it, it, yeah, it should be about 30,000 people in that area. But, um, that's still like, that's doable. Especially if they keep coming towards you. Like, obviously, then you have to deal with the whole, like, mental anguish of, I've killed 30,000 people, but, like, if it's between you or them, okay, I'm not gonna stop back home first. Um, I don't think. I'm actually going to modify. Drop you on there. Uh, apparently, I could do that the whole time. Yikes. Okay. I look, I look so primitive. It's so cool. Okay, in we go. 
Hello, sirs and ma'ams. Um, I desire your death. No one, no one up top? Really? Alright. We'll leave that open for a quick escape. Ah, I know this place. I've done it before. Waking you all up. Come on. It goes immediately to the um, burnt forest sound effects. Which is funny because we're not in a burnt forest. I don't think a burnt forest can even exist here. Die. Burn victims. Victims of the fire. The cursed fire. Oi, come on. Okay, someone is smacking on something metal. Which is kind of frustrating because I can't see them. Upsy daisy. Wish I could see where you were. Okay, opening you so that I have myself. The escape route. Where? I know- I heard a zombie. I heard a zombie. I continue to hear a zombie. I'm gonna- I don't wanna just sit here and wait for him to figure out- or her. Could be her, but I'm pretty sure it's a him. Cause it's all burn victims in here. Hello? Okay, apparently it's not all burn victims in here. There is one dude that managed to survive the fire. Okay, sure. Oh! Pipe rifle anyways! Well, alright. Modify you. Shove you up there. Okay. Okay, he's not gonna be able to get to me because uh, this requires parkour and zombies can't really parkour that well. We're gonna go on ahead and, uh, Load up all my weapons. Then we're going to do this. Loot everything. Alrighty. Shamway seals sipping. Sipping? Like sipping moonshine? No, shipping. Like sending. Uh, okay, we'll do that. Yes, and I can now make cornbread and tea. Just. Call me a regular southern bell, I guess. Where? Okay. I'm gonna go on ahead and actually just break this floor open. Because I don't really feel like dropping down there. He knows I'm up here. I know he knows I'm up here. He and I both know where each other are. He's down in there, beating on the wall. Like a loser. I'm beating on the floor. Like a, like a genius. Um... Or where is he? Um, let's shoot in there. Okay, he's just standing there. Well, that like completely counted as like. Oh. Okay, well- Oh! Oh, that's a- that's a crawler! Oh, that's what- okay. Whoever that is is a crawler, not part of the- not part of the thing. Oh. There's a small horde of zombies. I'm just gonna head back to the trader, turn in the quest, get the reward. Um, and then nerd stack up to- to the world limit, because I don't believe in sitting on the ground, waiting for the zombies to come find me. No sorry. I hide like a coward because here's the motto. If you're in an apocalyptic scenario, the cowards survive. People who don't go risking their lives for others in an apocalypse, they survive. First of all, kill 30,000 people to clear out the immediate area so the zombies can't find you. And then act like a coward. Just stop. I'm not recommending that you nuke an entire area because then you've hit survivors and zombies alike. 
I'm looking at you, Resident Evil. But I am recommending that at any time, if you see a zombie, just boom, take that head out. They might look like your friends and loved ones, but they're lying to you. Oh my goodness, is that machine gun parts? Oh, you just got, you were just throwing those away? Why are you just throwing away machine gun parts? I'm gonna take them. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna take those. Those are, those are mine now. Those are mine. Congrats, you lost machine gun parts. Now I can, like, start making an M60. Yeah, so we're gonna head home. We're going to nerd stack up into the sky like a bunch of cowards. Um, and then uh, we're gonna wait for the morning. So I will see you guys tomorrow um, when, you know, the zombies stop being athletic long sprinters. I, I don't even, I don't even know what I'm saying there. Athletic long sprint sprinters. Come on, it's the Olympic long jumpers, and then the sprint racers. Do I even, bro? <laughs> Anyways, we're gonna head. We are going to head um, home. Do that, and uh, yeah. I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. I hope that I can get um, up to 100 subscribers by year end. That would be a lot of fun. <laughs> I really hope I can do that. Um, Thank you guys so much, and I hope that you have a wonderful rest of your day. Most importantly of all, peace out.